explore the world and find a place for myself in it. When I got the call. We were all young, some of us not even old enough to know the touch of a woman, the taste of the devil's sweat, barely able to hold a rifle, never mind fired accurately. We discovered early on that there was a very slim chance of any of us were going to see home again. Young men thrust into a hell unlike any nightmare they could imagine. Years of pain, years of overwhelming fear, years of counting the seconds because that's all you could count on. Minutes, hours, seemed like a lifetime away. I may have seen home again, but it was not the home I left. Everything changed and nothing was the same again. I have carried this burden with me, unable to shake the darkness from my mind, however I try, whatever I do. The war never ended for me, I'm still there, lost in a tunnel, the light at the end of it always moving further away the closer I move towards it. If ever there is a reason not to exist, I am it. I just pray the eternal darkness is less painful than the darkness I've been lost in for 56 years. Eddie, soldier. Do you know how many men I have under me right now? No, sir. A great many. But why is it that I always seem to have you in front of me? That I don't know, sir. Do you know what you have? A great big precarious chip on your shoulder. I don't believe I do, sir. <laughs> you do. When I was first told that you were going to be here, I had my reservations. And all this behavior, it's just reaffirmed my beliefs. Are you unhappy with the U.S. Army, sir? No, sir. Seems to me that you're expecting something from us that we can't deliver. Does that sound about right, Sergeant? Permission to speak frankly, sir? Go ahead. It's not that the U.S. Army owes me anything, sir. What is it then? Spit it out. I have seen men come and go. Reinforcements that disappear as quickly as they appear. Yeah, well, that is not new. That's the nature of this business. Are you unhappy? No, sir. This is war, Sergeant. You don't get to pick and choose us on your team. Do you understand that? That's not what I meant, sir. You still haven't debriefed me about your capture. I will, sir. Not on record. I don't want the men to get the wrong idea about the SS. If they find out that these SS are human, that might be bad for morale. We want these men hungry for blood. One thing that bothers me, I still have difficulty understanding the circumstances of your escape. They let me go, sir. They let you go. Hasn't made you soft, has it? No, sir. We are liberators. We are moments away from vanquishing this tyranny in Europe, and I cannot afford any mishaps. There will be no mishaps, sir. I have a new mission for you. There's a farm to the south of here, and we're using it as a strategic base. It would be very important for the war if it is a springboard for incoming supplies from the Mediterranean. I want you and your crew to scout the line there and report if the Germans are planning a counteroffensive in the area. 
Pardon my candor, but that sounds like hogwash. Sergeant, you are speaking to an officer. Put your mouth. I am a tech commander. You're hiding me in some dead-end location. My crew and I were trained to beat Rommel in Africa. The front offensive has its own momentum right now, and I do not want to have to keep an eye on you while we're entering Germany. You're a fine tank commander, but outside of the walls of that armored vehicle, you are a liability. That is all. Get your orders from Rogers. Dismissed. This is the one. Ha! <laughs> I told you. I had him over. You gambling? Sorry, sir. What game are you playing? Craps, sir. How much have you lost so far? I don't lose. Not with my lucky dice. <laughs> the luck won't keep you alive forever. We weren't gambling for money anyway. We're gambling for smoke, sir. If not gambling for something more meaningful, then it's not gambling at all. Yes, sir. Pack your gear. We're heading out in two hours. Where to? South. To the front? A strategic base. That's some bullshit. So. How are we getting there? On foot? We don't have a tank. I don't know. Something new they've developed. And a driver? One will be assigned. Make an inventory and collect what you can scrounge. Sir, can I ask a question? Go ahead. What exactly did you do for us to get this bullshit mission? Nothing you don't know already. Is this a ruse? What do you mean? We're we going for gold. I have no idea what you're talking about. Much. Half an inch thick. That's not even gonna stop a panzer if we get caught. Yeah, but we got speed on our side. I'm not getting in this thing. This feels like a demotion. You say we'll have speed. 
How fast? Up to 40 miles an hour, sir. 50 if I really push it. You my new driver? Correct, sir. Milton Bailey, sir. How old are you? Old enough to shave, sir. <laughs> shave what? There's no hair on your face. How much combat have you seen? None, sir. That's another reason why I'm not getting in that thing. I've been driving since I was 13. This is no bigger than a tractor on my uncle's farm. You got crouch shooting at you on your uncle's farm? No. And you don't know what you're talking about? Sir, if I may. Go ahead. As I understand it, you need a driver. I may not have seen combat, but I can drive. I was trained in basic. And she can move when things go haywire. Haywire? When things get out of control? Is that right? I don't ask much from my crew. The only thing I ask is just don't get me killed. I will do the same in return. Affirmative, sir. Don't fuck with me, sir. I am the last person you want to fuck with. If I give you an order, you follow that order, no question. I am your mother, your father, your priest, your rabbi. You do as I say, and maybe we will get out of this thing alive. You say you can drive this thing. Yes, sir. Good. Do you know what our mission is? No, sir. All right. We ship out in 10 minutes. Is he always this accommodating? Listen. So you've seen a man blow up in front of you. His insides all over your outsides. And you can talk to me. Until then, if you keep your eyes on the road. Don't mind them. We lost our driver is all. They all took a bad. We all took a bad. I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Just don't get us killed. You comfy up there? As comfy as we'll ever be. I hope you know what you're doing. Piece of cake. Everyone accounted for? Aye, aye, Captain. Aye, aye. Aye, aye. That's a naval term, isn't it? My father was a Navy man. If you have a problem with how I command my crew. No, sir. Let's head out. Where are we headed? Need to know basis, driver. I meant which way? Left. The Belgian front? We're not headed to the front. Well, then where are we Your going? Your job is to drive. His job is to tell you which way. Don't ask questions. Yes, sir. You keep us off all major roads.
much action have you seen? That's a very personal question. Sorry. Didn't Chief. Didn't anything by it. How much action have we seen? Between Africa and France? More than I care to elaborate on. You've all been together since Africa? Mostly. Bobby joined after we entered France. Is he all right? We took him in when all the unit wanted him. He's been through a lot. He was there on D-Day. Landings? One of the first. I heard it was hell. If you weren't there, then you have no idea. He won't talk about it, but I've heard stories from others that were there. The few that survived. Half the time you don't know what to believe, but one thing is mentioned a lot. It was mayhem. Then something happened when they started to move inland. He won't say what, but it shook him. Right to the bone. He hasn't been the same since. I don't like this. Feel burning spiders over here. Just keep low. I see something. On the ground, on the left, between the trees. <laughs> What is it? I don't know. Where are you going? Stay here. Anything happens, I tail it. If you see anything, you shoot first. What is it, Charles? I don't rightly know. Stay here. If you hear anything, drive. Don't leave me. Guys! Guys! Just stay here. Guys! Flash. Flash. Enough. We don't use that anymore. What is this? Who knows? Most probably resistance. Harboring enemies of the Reich. But they're just civilians. I don't think it matters to them. Is it SS? Looks like it. 
We need to report this. No, someone will find it. What? We have our mission. This is our mission. This is not our mission. We can't just leave them. Charles is right. If we report this, we'll just be stuck here waiting for someone filling out paperwork. It'll delay our mission. I can't believe this. This is war. You'll see a lot more of this. You're crazy. Hey, what did I say? If you disobey my orders, I will have you shipped back to England where you'll be cleaning toilets for the rest of the war. Yeah? Well, maybe that'll be better than listening to this obvious bullshit. Listen to me. Because I'm only going to say this one more time. If I tell you to do something, you jump without question. It could be the difference between living and dying. <sighs> this is not right. None of this is right. Yeah, but this beyond not right. These people! These people are dead. And if we report it, or don't report it, it won't bring them back. We can't just do this. There are rules. Rules for who? Do you think they followed the rules? Orders, maybe. But rules. But they're animals. We're not. We're not animals? I guess you haven't been here since the beginning, but we've done some pretty disgusting things in this war, too. They don't print that in the papers back home because white middle-class people don't want to hear about the horrors their boys are doing in another country while eating their breakfast. If we don't do something... We are doing something. Every day, we roll close to Berlin. Every day, we squeeze the air out of the lungs of the SS, and one day, we will vanquish these fascists off the face of the earth. But until that day, there will be more of this. More bodies, more graves, more bloodshed. I'm radioing it in. I can't let you do that. Let go of me! Listen to what he says. I'm giving you an order. What is this, huh? What is this? What are we doing here? I'm going to repeat myself. They're children. Women and children. It don't matter to them. Why? How can a person do this to another person? I just don't get it. A whole village gone. Look, I know this is difficult to understand, but this isn't real life. Rules are guidelines, and guidelines will get you killed. We're expendable. The sooner you realize that, the better you'll sleep at night. He's crazy. I've been in this command for two years and I'm still here. That may be some higher power or dumb luck, but one thing is certain. If it wasn't for Charles' instincts, I wouldn't be here talking to you right now. He saved my ass so many times that I will never repay him, even if I live to a hundred. Hell. Get up and look. There are things worse than death. Come on. Where are you from, cowboy? What? Does it matter? Just being nice, soldier. Nebraska. <laughs> <laughs> you a corn husker? <laughs> Hello. 
Look, I know I'm the new kid, but you ain't gonna bust my balls about it, right? Sit closer. So, is uh, your diet corn or beef? <laughs> <laughs> drive one of those harvesting machines. <laughs> no, I'm impressed. It's not that hard, machines. Once you're in control, pretty much in charge. I bet it feels good to be up that high. Engine growling underneath you like a tiger, ready to pounce. Yeah, something like that. to get back home and see my wife. I haven't seen her for three years. She's probably got tired of waiting for her ass and taking up with some kid with a bum leg who couldn't enlist. You take that back. <laughs> yeah, I'm just saying. Don't get your hopes up. I won't be the same when we get back. If we get back, Ask what her mission is. Need to know basis. And I don't need to know. The less you know, the better. This isn't a covert operation, is it? I wasn't told. It's not covert, but we need to keep a low profile. Can I at least ask where we're going? Who's hungry? You know what you're doing. We could get into a lot of trouble for this. Where'd you even get this? Never mind where I got it. Do you trust me? Of course. But if it comes to it, I'm pleading ignorance. All right. I don't expect you to take the fall for any of this. But the benefit outweighs the risk. You still in? And let you have all the fun? What about him? I'll keep him in line. He'll come around when we find it. <laughs> Poor bastard.
bring us to a stop. Morning, chaps. You're all I me? Captain Grant Chapman. Sergeant Charles Taylor. A pleasure to meet you, Sergeant. Are you separated from your unit? Something like that. I was doing a drop three nights ago, headed to Berlin. Full electronic failure. Lucky I jumped when I did, really. Just in time to see her go down. Fortunate, really. Otherwise, I would have been demoted to a corpse. Demoted to a corpse. Anyway, tell me, didn't know there were any Yanks in this area. What brings you out this far? Recon mission. Hmm. I see. Say, I recognize this piece of kit. Greyhound, isn't it? What they say? What a beautiful machine. Albeit not very well armored. May I ask, where is your support? Our mission is reconnaissance. We need to travel light and she is speed in case we need to get away fast. Mm-hmm. Driver, how does she handle in a skirmish? I'll let you know if we come across any. He's green. A few days ago. Well, I do hope he's good behind the wheel. I guess we'll see. Right. Which way are we headed? I would most appreciate a lift. I don't think we'll encounter any of your units where we're going. If it's all the same to you, I'd much rather have the company in these parts than to trek it back alone. Something wrong here. And not just because there's a war going on. Something unnerving about this area. How so? I just find it peculiar. Done this route three times. Each time there's been an occurrence. What do you mean? Just that, an occurrence. Nothing big. Just feels this place brings bad luck. <laughs> I think you've been out on your own here for too long. <laughs> Listen. I don't hear anything. Exactly. Don't you find it strange that there's a war going on and it's very quiet. So, it's all the same to you. I'd much rather not be out here on my own. Anyone see where that came from? Come on, get this thing moving.
Dale? Du weißt nicht, was du da machst hast. No! Fuck! Dale? Sorry, boss. My finger slipped. I told you I wanted them alive. I wouldn't go near there if I were you. You don't know what's going to be in the back. If there's anyone in there, come out with your hands raised. Come, Enzi. Out. Come out. Reckon the English? Deutsch. Is there anyone else in there? Well, I'll be clear the vehicle. Driver's dead. Check the back. Anything? I don't really know, sir. What is it? Even if I explain it to you, you won't believe me. What is it? Watch him. Is it clear? Oh, it's clear, you'll see.
What's going on here? Ich war es nicht. Ich hatte nicht damit zu tun. English? Who is this? Why is she tied up? Ich war es nicht. Ich hatte nicht damit zu tun. Whether you speak German? I know how to say suck my dick. If that helps. Untie her. Ich will nicht. Warum? Gefährlich. That little girl. Is she resistance? No, Widerstand? Nein! Schlechte! Bad. Oh, so you do speak in English. Bobby, I'm tired. Not me. Because he won't. I got him covered. Why don't you do it? Gonna hurt you. Sprechen Sie English? Deutsch? Francais? Okay. What's going on there? I don't know. Just be ready. It's okay. Uh, I'm not gonna hurt you. Okay. I'm gonna untie you. What's going on? Oh, fuck this. I'm gonna find out what's going on. What's going on? I told you to stay there. Well, I thought you needed my... Shit. I don't like this. There's something seriously off. She was tied up in there, not just cuffed. Those are some serious knots. Does this change our mission? What is our mission? Why are we here? 
and no more bullshit. Fine. I'll tell you enough. But I want assurances. What kind of assurances? This isn't strictly on the up and up. Well, I presume that. How deep are we? And there's the rub. I was captured a month ago. We were on an assignment. We were part of a convoy to the front. We were ambushed. I ran, but in the confusion, I didn't realize I was running straight towards them. They didn't turn me in. Kept me around. One of them spoke English. He was very accommodating. I didn't understand it. I was the enemy. I knew my days were numbered, but it felt like it would come any minute without warning. They wouldn't kill me. Maybe it was torture, because it felt like torture. I overheard them talking about a treasure, shafts. I didn't get all the details, but as I understand it, there's a treasure that Hitler is coveting somewhere east of Paris. Now I'm what you would call a pragmatist. I know I'm not gonna see home again, but in the unlikely instance, I do make it back. We make it back. I would like something for the effort. Aside from what the government pay. Assurances. And then they let me go. Just like that? Just like that. Guess they didn't want to drag a hostage along. Not where they were going. Right before they sent me on my way, I said to them, Thank God you're not SS. <laughs> you two knew about this? I'm just along for the ride. I can't believe it. We're AWOL. We're going back. It's a temporary detour. Once we find what it is that Hitler is hiding around here, then we'll return. If anyone asked anything... Ah, oh, so you blame it all on me, yeah? That's about the size of it. <laughs> what happens when they don't find us at our post? Oh, it's a babysitting mission, far behind the front line. This is Tarku! It'll be all right. What's Tarku? Soldat. What is it? Not so. What's your name? Werner. Falcon. Werner. Yeah. Milton. The Freud. Was hast du mit mir vor? I don't understand. What um, do I don't know?
And who are you? What are we going to do with the crowd? Is our mission X? No. I, I don't know. Well, we can't take him with us, whatever we do. Maybe we can use him as collateral. How? He must know something. He can take us. I don't know. He looks like a grunt. <laughs> if he knows anything, it'll be a miracle. What do you suggest? Cut him loose. We ain't cutting him loose. If we do that, we'll have a whole platoon in our ass as soon as he get back to his crap friends. Well, I'm not killing him. We're in war. If we don't kill him, then he sure as shit won't hesitate to kill us. Well, he's a prisoner. He's unarmed. He's still a soldier. And you're a soldier. And they set you free. That's different. How is that any different? Different circumstances. We've moved on from there. What does that mean? We are on a mission. Nothing interferes with our objective. Rightly so. Oh, so you're taking his side. I'm taking no one's side. <laughs> and what about the girl? <laughs> Is she a prisoner? Are you going to set her free or execute her too? No one said anything about executing anyone. <sighs> but that's what Hothead here was implying. Jesus, Edge. <laughs> And why was she tied up? That's not normal. Y'all all right? It's getting dark. We're gonna have to camp here. We'll figure it out in the morning. Wasser. Was ist das in uh, English? Water. Water. Uh, you two having a good time? Sorry, sir. I, I, I just... We just... Just nothing. You're fraternizing with a prisoner. Sorry, sir. So dark. Cigaretta. Sit Hello?
I'm so sorry. It's so cold. <laughs> we head out in twenty. Fuck! <sighs> Fucking bears. This isn't a bear. How do you know? The wounds are too small. What is it then? Human. But it won't me. Yeah? He was the one who wanted him executed. Whoa, 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 it won't me. How could you? After what you said two days ago. Listen here, buddy. It won't me. He was unarmed! <laughs> Get this cycle off me! What's your problem? You! Right now, you're my problem! I didn't do anything. I know you did. Guys? You got hate wife. Guys! Oh my God. There's somewhere wrong here. Piece of shit. What's wrong? I think we're so far out of range that we're not even getting static anymore. Is that bad? Whoa! Oh, shit. Fuck. Oh. What the fuck was that? Landmine. Why the hell didn't you drive around it? They're designed not to be seen. 
I don't have x-ray vision, do I? Then you crap my head open. We hit a landmine. I think it misfired. Could have blown through the hole, blown a tire. I guess we're lucky, yet again. Uh, I think we have a problem. Can you fix it? I can fix it. How much time? Probably take a day. I'll delay us by miles. Okay. You stay here and fix it. Bobby will stand guard. I'm not staying with him. Dale and I will go ahead and scout the area. At least then we're not all standing here collecting dust. We'll be left out in the open. We'll push her off into a fucking thicket. We have to bring her. She insisted. Did she tell you that? Because the last time I checked, she still hasn't said anything. She could have stayed, but she chose to tag along. She makes me uncomfortable. Me too. But there's something else. What? It's as if we were meant to find her. Are you going soft? No, nothing like that. You ever picked up a stray? Uh huh. Well, it's like that. Or they could be tick ridden and carrying some disease, but you take them anyway. I think it's called compassion. You really have gone soft. You know what I mean. I think I do. We're still on mission. Let's keep moving. There's probably craps around us as we speak. Ow! How long this going to take? I'm tired of babysitting you. It's only been half an hour. Half an hour, half a day, it's all the same when you're doing nothing. Just go then. I can look after myself. <laughs> I've seen you fight, pretty boy. And it ain't pretty. Just shut the fuck up. Keep your eyes open. Aye, aye, Captain. Charles? What is she doing? I don't know. Hey! I think this is it. What is she saying? That's where her heart is. W what does that mean? Where is she going? She wants our help. This is a mistake.
Holy Jesus. Milton, I'm just going to go check out something. Tu arrives là Hey Amérique Tu aurais pas des lettres English Oui, euh, elle est là. Oh, someone speaks English. Sorry to break up this reunion, but where are we? What is this place? Outside Strasbourg, a uh, medical facility. Strasbourg? We're right by the border. We need to get out of here. Shit! We have company. How many? <laughs> Two so far, but those shots will bring in more. Sitting ducks in here. Mathilde, no. Wait, what's she doing? She is protecting us. Halt! going on here? Hello? Am I dreaming? Are you real? I thought I killed you. How? I held you, and there was nothing left. What is this place, and who are you? 
My name is Ida. Je suis, uh, I am a doctor here. And why were you tied up? They were clearing people out. They were closing us down. It is uh, too dangerous with the, the war coming this way. Who was the girl here? Mathilde, oui. She is uh, one of our best. Best what? Creations. What do you mean? She is uh, not human, not really. What is she? A weapon. It is shut. Bobby! Bobby, where are you going? God damn it. You're making a big mistake, buddy. Please, it. Okay. But I did warn you. Oh, I'm glad you didn't miss. I was aiming for the heart. <laughs> Damn. What the hell do? I think I'm hit. No, well, it's not that bad. I'm no medic, but even I know this is bad. This is the end. You can't, you can't go. I won't let you go. Well, my luck had to run out sometime. Luck had nothing to do with it. Here. Take these. No, I can't take She's those. always been good to me. I won't be needing them where I'm going. I'm the lucky one. This is what makes it so hard. <laughs> Permission to take leave, Sergeant. Permission granted, soldier.
too many of them and I'm almost out. Where's Dale? Didn't make it. Where's Bobby? Didn't make it. Jesus fucking Christ. Wait, wait. We need to wait for Mathilde. She's still inside. She can handle herself. your britches. Is that where they kept you? No. There are uh, medical facilities where they are experimenting. I was there to be transported to one of them. Are there lots of those places? I worked in uh, three of them, but I, uh, I do not know how many more there are. Where are they taking her? They're taking her to be killed. Why? Because uh, she does not do what she is told. She is uh, dangerous because uh, she, she thinks. They, uh, they thought making her intelligent would be better, but uh, they cannot control her. I guess it's our luck she thinks for herself, <laughs> not for them. Oui. Where are we headed? Can you show us where to find these facilities? Why? Something needs to be done. If the Nazis finish what they started here, then more innocent people are going to die. I do not want it. So can you show us where to find these places? Where? North. I uh, do not know the town, but I uh, know how to get there. We're going north. Aye, aye.
Many would envy what I had. I survived the war, came back to America, built a life. But the darkness took over. It just needed something to latch on to. And if they knew what I was carrying in my veins, they wouldn't have let me leave the military. <laughs>